Hi everyone, I'm Alessandro, CEO of Baja Boards, and today I'm going to talk the difference between S2 and a G4X. Before we start, make sure you watch the video until the end because we are going to talk about the upcoming USA Tour. One of the most obvious differences between the S2 and a G4X is the weight and size. The S2 is quite a bit shorter and just a little bit narrower compared to the G4X. The S2 can use 8 and 10 inch tires, instead the G4X can only use 10 inch tires. The S2 starting weight is about 15 and a half kilograms, instead the G4 starting weight is about 20 to 21 kilograms. The difference in power and speed between these two boards is quite different. One of the main reasons is that the S2 only come in two drive versions, so only two motors at the rear. The G4 can come in a two wheel drive or four wheel drive uh, version. Obviously, a four wheel drive version have a lot more power, torque, and top speed compared to the S2 or the same G4 with two wheel drive. One of the main reasons is because the G4X uh, has four motors, but also because the battery, even if it's a very similar size as the S2, it has a lot more power that can deliver to the motor. So instead of having a lot of range, it has a lot of power. Light option. Both of these boards come with optional lights. Uh, both of these boards have headlights and uh, tail lights. Now the difference between the headlights is that S2, you can program how fast the headlight you want to flash. Instead with G4X, uh, you can program to have um, a different brightness. So very powerful or very dim. One of the main differences of the light package is that the S2 also comes with the indicators. The G4, G4X, it does not come with indicators. Both of these boards have a very similar capacity battery. The battery for the G4X is designed for uh, delivering high current and high power uh, to the four motors. Instead, the S2 battery is designed to have still a good uh, acceleration, good power, but also to last very long, so have a very long range. So here the trade-off is that one has a very high power and one has a very long range. The similarity of these two boards are uh, actually quite a few. So as we already mentioned in uh, some of the previous video is that they share a lot of components uh, like a drivetrain, uh, uh, motors, uh, motor controllers, uh, and uh, a lot of other uh, parts. For example, one of the very important parts they share is also the remote controller. So whether you're buying the S2 or a G4X, uh, you're still getting the same high quality remote controller. The ground clearance of both these two boards uh, are actually quite similar if you get the same size wheel. So obviously with an eight inch wheel, the clearance of these boards would be a lot less uh, than what you will get with a G4. Uh, but if you go with a 10 inch and 10 inch, the cl clearance will be very similar. The most obvious difference between a S2 and a G4 is the suspension system. The G4 offer a double wishbone independent suspension system, instead the S2 has a monoshock system. The benefit of a G4 suspension system is that there is a shock per wheel. That means that the 60 meter travel that the suspension offer will be absorbed per wheel. Instead with the S2 monoshock suspension system, you have uh, the travel of that single suspension shared between the two wheels. The monoshock suspension system offer a smaller, lighter and less part, which means less things could go wrong. This system also offer a greater dampening of a small cracks or small uh, bumps. Instead, the S2 offer a better performance uh, and a greater travel over heavy off-road. Uh. Another great benefit of this suspension system is that you can use a shock. The reason that you cannot use a shock in this board is that the air shock has a initial friction when uh, you start compressing and uh, having four in a single board, uh, your weight will not be enough to overcome the friction. Instead with the S2 having only two of these suspensions, it's enough to still have a great performance even with the air shock. To compare the specs of these two boards, it obviously depends on the difference of the option that you decide to get. But just to give you an idea is that the top speed of this board goes between 50 km per hour to 
just under 60 km per hour. And uh, instead for the G4, G4X, uh, it starts around 55 km per hour and it goes just above 60 km per hour. Difference in acceleration is this board, uh, being a four-wheel drive, has heaps more acceleration compared to this one and has heaps more traction compared to this one. The range of the S2 is between 30 to 60 kilometers. The range of the G4 is between 22 to 35, 36 kilometers. The weight of the S2 is, starts from 15 and a half kilograms up to 18 and a half kilograms. The weight of the G4 starts around 20 and a half kilograms up to 26 kilograms. What board is best for you? A G4 offer a great capability for heavy off-road thanks to the high clearance and high torque and the four-wheel drive option that you can get. Also, it's very stable high speed, so it's also a great board for on-road condition if you are looking to, to do very high speed. The S2 instead is a little board that can offer still great performance for off-road, uh, but it's also a lot easier to ride uh, on-road because it's a lot more nimble compared to the G4. My recommendation here is that if you want a board to go very fast uh, or uh, really off-road, go with this board. If you instead want a board for commuting and every now and then going for off-road or do jumps, then go with this board. If you live in USA and you would like to test a S2 or a G4, it's a great time because we are coming to you in September. The first event uh, will be at uh, the Filipaki NYEF uh, on the 14th of September. Uh, after that, we will have a demo ride uh, on the 15th of September, uh, still in New York. Then the 21st of September, we'll have a demo ride in San Francisco. The 22nd of September, we'll have a demo ride in Los Angeles. And the 23rd of September, we'll have a demo ride in San Diego. During this event, uh, we'll be giving away t-shirts, stickers, uh, and vouchers uh, that you can spend uh, on our store. So if you are in really interested in buying one of these boards, uh, you could get an uh, extra discount uh, on top of uh, the uh, total price. So if you live close to any of these cities, uh, make sure you go and check uh, our Facebook page where we have all the details of the event, uh, where it starts, the point that it starts, uh, and all the information. We look forward to see you there, so make sure you come.